and he said, because of the need to find a solution to the myriad of problems yes. facing the country, the president said, okay, let's do this. And because also the Nigerians have been clamoring for this, is it not something to give them a thumbs up for? Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you very much. You have, you have raised a very important issue. But uh, I, I will throw the, back, uh, the question back to millions of Nigerians. The question is, is it the constitutional conference that will, that will fix Lagos in Ibadan expressly? Is it the constitutional conference that will provide electricity for Nigeria? Is it the constitutional conference that will provide jobs for millions of uh, youths who are not in the street? Is it the constitutional conference that will solve the problem of the uh, education sector? Look, in as much as I want Nigeria to sit down to talk, but the reality is that Nigeria needs infrastructural development. Nigeria needs to for, Nigeria is so static to do this. And it, it, the conference alone cannot provide solution for all the, to all, the, all, all these things. When the president was campaigning in 2011, he never promised Nigerians a constitutional conference. He promised us electricity, he promised us transformation agenda. I think the president will run that into logical conclusion. Perhaps if the president had done a quarter of all those things and he did not come up with a constitutional conference, a time Nigerians were blazing. That is, the, that is the, that Nigerians are the most, uh, they are the most good people to rule all over the world. Nigerians just ask for tokenism from their government. So give us road, give us electricity, give us job, give us this. That is the point. You know, as they go around, especially the advisory uh, committee, today yes. they'll be meeting in Ondo State. Yes. What should be coming from the people? What do you think the people want? Uh, you're from Southwest Nigeria, because I was actually started. Uh, taking people from different geopolitical zones on the program. Uh, for some, they were talking about resource control and the likes. For you and your people, what's the vibe you're getting? Yes, uh, let, let me... Or you, don't you think you would want to participate? Uh, Chief of Governor Ola said it. We never, we never, we never left, you know, to, we never leave a vacuum in the political space. I would expect the, uh, the Southwest people to go there and participate. But even at that, you are starting the, con the consultation in the southwest, in Akure, on the state capital. It speaks volume of this uh, conference. This team should also have taken place in the Badon, which is the political capital of the Yoruba land. So, so that is why people started reading me to all this kind of uh, thing. You, go, you, you are consulting in the southwest, you took it to Akure. <laughs> I, I will leave I will leave it I will leave it I will leave it I will leave it at that. What does it matter? <laughs> what does what does the venue matter? Uh, the Yoruba. What, what if? I mean, have they said that that is the only place they're going to be consulting in in the southwest? Uh, see, the Yoruba, Yoruba has a culture. Uh, with, with your sincere apologies to millions of Nigerians, the most sophisticated political party in Nigeria, the Yoruba. Uh, no, 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 yes, I, I'm saying this with thousands of people. Mr. Tanaku, what I'm saying is, what the, have you confirmed that this is the only venue no, uh, uh, in which the consultations will be it, taking take, place? No, it's taking place in two places in the southwest, mm -hmm. Akure and Lagos. Mm -hmm. But I'm telling you, by the political thermometer in the southwest, if this conference, if this consultation is supposed to take place at the, at the first go, this conference is supposed to take place in the battle, which is the political capital of Yoruba land. Are you not also taking into consideration yeah. the, uh, the, the political configuration? For instance, the fact that the Ondo State is under Labour Party currently, and the rest of the Southwest seems to be with the APC, as it were. That is that is what that is that is why that is why it's, it's even more important for you, if you are serious about this conference, to carry those people who who, who seem to hold the political uh, the political. A street or the or the or, or the Yoruba, Lagos uh, state is uh, under APC. Uh, the, look, I, I've said it that, that the fact that I'm starting a career, you know, it holds it holds a volume for for it. And let me clear it. Many people believe that Governor uh, Miko is in the is the Labour Party, but it's a PDP man in my heart. That's the bitter truth. Unless you, we can go to, we can go and confirm that. That is the, the speculation. Yeah, that, no, I don't, I don't, that, it's that, very different from reality. Here. But look. In fact, I'm not even talking about Lagos. Because if you, if you are a student of Yoruba uh, politics very well, Lagos is not even one of the... So you would say uh, that the uh, conference uh, should hold... Every, consultations can hold everywhere but not Lagos. Is that what I, you're also I'm saying? Not, I'm not saying so. I'm saying that if consultation must be, you know, start from the start world, which is very good, it should be taken to the political capital of yeah. Yoruba land. From Lagos. Uh, sorry yes. about that. From Lagos. Uh, let me just try and see if I can get something out. From Lagos down to Ondo State. Yes. Uh, from Lagos, which is the last southwest state? Yes. When you travel from Lagos down? Yes. 
if you travel from Lagos down, which uh, should be the last? Undo is the last. So in, in, other ways, in other words, they've been able to cover the beginning and the end, and every other one who is in the middle can actually go to different venues. Well, uh, it, it, it depends. I don't want us to dwell so much on this uh, venue, team, but I just want I, I just point out a very important uh, important point. But because look, I'm sure they are listening. They yes, should be able when, to, uh, when well, when 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 it took place in Ibadan, where Abraham, Abraham Adesanya was elected at the, Yoruba, or the leader of the Yorubas. Abraham Adesanya had this stay in Lagos. And most, the majority of those who were fighting there, they were in Lagos. But because of the political significance of that particular ancient town, where Abraham was a, was a colossal, where Abraham did so many things, you know, you know, they, they went there. What I'm saying in essence is that, aha, that one would have given us, you know, everybody the, the basis to, 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 do, to, to do that. Nevertheless, wherever they start, I don't think I have any problem with that. And uh, you've still not been able to tell us what you think that uh, will yes. be some of uh, the look, demands of your people. Uh, look, there, there are many. Take for example, for example, in Lagos. Lagos and Kano in the 60s share almost the same number of uh, local government. Between there and now, Jigawa State has been cut out of Kano. As I'm talking to you now, Jigawa State has 27 local government, while, while Kano has 40 local government. As of today, Lagos, with a population of uh, close to about 70 to 80 million, also ha has 20 local go government. Forgot about the LCD that was created that has not been ratified today. I think they should be talking, they should, the, the people should be talking about, about, about that. Secondly, I think the people should be talking about the need to reform more power to the state and the local, go and the, and the local government so that they, they will have more resources at their disposal you know, to, 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 to bring dividends of democracy to, 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 to millions of uh, people uh, you know, at, at, uh, you know, at, at, at their home. So I think. The demands basically should be on how to you know, take power to the so that the power will get down to the, to the grassroots. I, I know the difference of Undo, uh, perhaps will differ from the Rota for you, will differ from part of Lagos. But specifically, it, in speaking terms, I think this, this should be the focus of the, of the Yoruba. Well, grassroots uh, development, yes. that's what we're getting from you, Udo uh, Wajanaku, yes. public affairs analyst. Many thanks for coming on Sunrise Dinner today. Very much.